Hello everyone. I'm System back again with some Black Ops gameplay. I don't think that's right. uh, this one was laying around on my hard drive for a while, uh, and uh, I was going through looking, an clearing them out, checking out what I had, and this one caught my eye, so I figured, you know what, it's a decent game for me. I'm gonna throw it up. I'm not gonna talk too much about it. What I'm gonna talk about is uh, my gaming history, where I came from, and and where I want to go. Maybe not where I want to go, but more along the line of how I got started. I mean, we all got started. I, I I was around when the Nintendo first came out. And I begged for it, and I begged for it, and I finally got it. And it wasn't cheap back in the day. Uh, I believe it was a couple hundred bucks. And back, in, back then, a couple hundred bucks was a lot of money. Uh, but I got one, and I, I'd call. I, I would I would play uh, Mario Brothers and Duck Hunt. You get the double one. You pop it in, you can play Super Mario Brothers or Duck Hunt. I played the shit out of those. Uh, anyhow, bring it up farther on, uh, get into these first-person shooters. Um, I played PC. Uh, back in about 2002, I finally got a PC to play video games on. And I went out, and the first game I got was Battlefield 1942. Now, I know you're saying, hey, you're playing Black Ops. Why are you talking about Battlefield? Well, I'll get there. Uh, when I first found this game, it was uh, I was renting a... PS, PS2 game from Blockbuster and the counter guy told me, hey, have you played that Battlefield 1942 on the PC? And I'm like, what is that? And he's like, oh, it's a new first person shooter where you play with like 32 other people against 32 people and there's planes and there's jets and there's big airplanes and there's explosions, there's tankers, there's there's everything. There's jeeps running around, and every single one is controlled by a real person somewhere. And I'm like, are you kidding me? Because we couldn't do anything like that on the PS2. Uh, sure, you know we had we had SOCOM. I played that. It was decent, but it just it wasn't on par with multiplayer nowadays. So what I do? I run out and I get it. I install it, and from that day on, I've been hooked on first-person shooters, and I can't get off of them. It was just amazing. I mean, come on, we need to get back to that point. And now, now we're back to the days. Uh, come on, 64 player online. What do we get now? Most 16, if we're lucky, on these consoles. You know, so that's why I'm switching back to PC. That's the future for I'm System PC gaming. Uh, I'm gonna get Battlefield 3. Okay, I'm I'm gonna be getting it for the PC. I've already got the alpha invite. The game's amazing. It looks beautiful, but it's still... I don't believe they're going to have 32 versus 32. We need to get back on this level. This little 8-man, eight 8-man, eight just... It doesn't cut it. We they, they got bad company, and it's still... I don't... What is that, 32? No, I don't know. I don't think so. I think it's like 16, 16 still. Anyhow, then my Call of Duty times, okay? So, me and my friends, we, we were getting bored of uh, Battlefield 1942. We had the expansion, Secret Weapons of War... Uh, whatever other ones came out it was it was fun and enjoyable but we needed to change all of a sudden call of duty comes out oh let's do it so we go out and we pick up call of duty now call of duty originally didn't have any vehicles or nothing so it was more fast-paced uh run and gun like they are today uh, we enjoyed it we played the crap out of it we got competitive we played some team warfare uh Team Warfare League, TWL, if you're familiar with that, we would uh, get a team and we would compete others on a ladder or in a league and, and, and get ranks. Uh, we never won money. We didn't. It wasn't M MLG. We weren't on that level. Uh, pro probably never will be on that level, but it was extremely fun. We did a 2v2 in the excitement. It was 2v2 capture the flag, me and my friend. And the, the excitement level, eh, just the intensity of that one match, even with 32 versus 32 couldn't be topped but we still wanted some battlefield you know it's just we missed Enemy out so then united you know. offensive came out hey they're adding tanks to call of duty jeeps what so we had to check that out and that that added a whole new level a lot of people didn't like it and i think that's the difference between call of duty and battlefield players uh, Call of Duty is more run and gun in your face, whereas Battlefield is more tactical, you know, take your time, plan it out, get it done. 
you have more to worry about. You got to worry about, you know, tanks and jets and helicopters and battlefield and Call of Duty. You just worry about the other guy. And you know, sure, there's kill streaks that added a whole new thing, but even then, you just shoot it down or you hide from it. You still, it's not at the same level of battlefield. Now I'm just ranting on you know, the difference. I'm sure people are gonna go off about the difference, but who cares? Play them both, enjoy it. I do both. I, I'm still gonna be getting Modern Warfare 3. Uh, I'll be playing the crap out of that. We'll see what happens. I'm moving away from that now. Uh, no, I didn't feel like getting into too much detail about my complete history and we'll bring you up to the level where I'm at now. It, you know, who wants to listen to that? Anyhow, I was thinking about doing these spoof commentaries. You know, people spoof games, you know, they spoof songs, uh, make fun of them, you know. I'm going to mimic other people like, you know, I already did El Presidor. That was my first video I commentated on. Uh, in case you didn't realize, it was a joke. I'm not trying to copy him. I'm just doing it as funny. So I have other commentators that I want to do the same thing about. I just need to get some gameplay footage. Some you might like, some you might not. But I'm not going to tell you who I plan on doing. But if, if you actually are listening to this commentary still, uh, let me know who you think I should do. I want some input. Give me some input. I want some input. I can't do it all by myself. Let me know. And if you don't think it's a good idea, then let me know. That's fine by me too. Now coming to the gameplay here. The game's uh, ending here. I, I didn't do that good. But I did good for me. 3.5 KDR. That's good. Game winning kill. That's not bad. We won. That's all that matters. Uh, you might hear in the background the kid on the other team's going off. He's pissed because, well, his team sucked. But if you come down to it, they had three people positive. We only had two, so I don't think it was a team thing there. In fact, it almost looks like I carried the team. But whatever. Uh, I'm system and I'm out of here.